Hi, May Susan. Thanks for being here today. Um, can you tell me a little bit about yourself? Yep, so I've just um, completed my Masters in Commerce at Sydney University with a major in Marketing and Strategy and Innovation. And I'm also the Customer Insights Manager at Woolworths. Wow, Customer Insights Manager at Woolworths. That sounds like a pretty challenging job. How in the world do you find the time to do postgraduate study? Well, many sleepless nights, red eyes <laughs> and no social life. Um, but really, it wasn't too bad with night classes and weekend intensive. It wasn't too bad at all. Uh, why did you do it? Why did you take such a big step? Yeah, look, the world is changing. As we know, it's changing very fast, which means the consumer market is changing, particularly with the advancements in technology, um, where we're seeing consumers embrace the internet and social media, and the role that it's starting to play in consumers' life is becoming much more prevalent. Competition is much more intensified across all markets or industries across the world, and also globalisation is having a significant impact on markets. So I really wanted to come back to develop a much deeper um, understanding in the latest thinking and practices of, of marketing within this new consumer environment. Okay, so, so give me one of these big ideas that uh, you, you got across when you were studying that really had a big impact on how you think about marketing. So the first biggest one was marketing myopia. So marketing myopia is a term that describes situations where business professionals become so immersed and close in a product or service that they're developing for a consumer that they actually lose sight of the end consumer and what the benefit is to the consumer. So it really has made me um, think about this in my current professional life as a customer insight manager and, and think about the consumer and always take a step back and reflect and put myself in the shoe of the customer and think what is it that they're getting out of what I'm trying to do? Well, how is it really going to impact their life in a, in a positive way? How is it going to make a difference for the customer? What about uh, something closer to home to your role as customer insights manager? Yeah, look, one of the things that we looked at was the decision-making process that consumers go through when they are trying to decide on what to buy. So it was all about how the brain works. And one of the things that we, we all see on a day-to-day -day, day -day basis, which we all experience as well, is we're bombarded with lots of information on a day-to-day -day basis. But also we're very time poor. So we don't really have the time to read the nitty-gritty detail of um, products and we, when we are trying to work out what it is that we buy, we just don't have the time to read all that detail. So I guess out of this course, it's made me realise that as a marketer, our role is really to try and simplify this process for consumers, keep the things simple to really make this process of decision making much more efficient and, e and easier for them. How about uh, general skills that you picked up along the way? Yeah, look, there's lots. Um, I, I do feel like I am a much more confident um, business professional. And also, look, in addition to some of the theories that we learn along the way, there's the acquisition of the softer skills, such as cross-cultural understanding, for example. And in the course, you are working with students from different countries, different levels of calibre, different industries. So it really teaches you to be much more culturally aware of the differences. And also, obviously, teamwork. Um, one of the biggest things that you do in, in a course like um, a Masters in Commerce is lots of teamwork activities. So it really helps you work better with different types of people. Well, first I want to say congratulations on your graduation. I know that you've finished this semester and uh, also want to wish you the best of luck on all your future business endeavors. Thanks again. Thank you.